the Solar Edge 3 phase residential inverter, that's the SE 5K, 7K, 8.25K, and 10K AUB, are all now compatible with the Solar Edge home battery. The stage one of the release is looking at single inverter sites with one home battery, communication via the home network, no Zigbee devices are allowed, and the firmware of 4.21.103 or higher. With regard to the DC connections, firstly ensure that the inverter is fully shut down and isolated, ensure that the battery circuit breakers and battery toggle are both in the off position, and use the supplied MC4 connectors to wire the battery DC. The three-phase residential inverter has a single DC input, so two connection options exist. Option one, join the PV DC and the battery DC inside the inverter DCD. For option two, join the PV DC and the battery DC inside the battery via the solar edge branch connector and run a single DC cable to the inverter. For the comms connection, only the solar edge home network communication protocol shall be used. Depending on the communication board within the inverter, install the correct EnergyNet card. There are two types of EnergyNet card, the HBNP-01 and the HBCL-01. The HBCL-01 is the larger energy net card that needs to be installed on communication boards that do not have the smaller connection port. On boards which do have the smaller connection port, ensure that the HBNP-01 is used only. With regards to metering, for MSC function, a solar edge meter is always required. Both of the solar edge meters can be used with a residential three-phase inverter. That's the solar edge Modbus meter with CTs via RS-485 connection, or the solar edge inline meter via RS-485 or the solar edge home network. Either shall be installed at the grid connection point in airport export configuration. For commissioning, turn on the battery MCB, move the battery toggle to the on position, turn on the DC isolator on the inverter, Move the inverter toggle to the on position, then switch on the AC to the inverter. To commission the battery, go to Setup, in Device Manager a new device should be shown, follow the guided prompts to set up the battery.